Excuse me. Hi. How much volume is that? How big is it inside? That's 31,000 cubic feet. That's impressive. Yeah, it's got a lift capacity of I think about 120 kilograms. No, it's must be more than that because the pilot's heavier than that. <laughs> My function here is as uh, crown lineman is I've got to regulate the, when the envelope fills, I've got to regulate the, the ascent so as the, the, the air going in doesn't cause any burning or, or uh, issues with the front end where the pilot currently is. And when it goes up to a certain extent, I'll ease the envelope up um, and then join them and do, do the other part just as a hopper so it's only one, one man, it's a one man chair. And yeah, it's great. And then when he finishes doing his thing and starts bobbing around, I'll go get my camera and do some photography. This is my one-man hot air balloon. It's called a cloud hopper. So instead of a basket, I sit in a seat with a five-point harness around me, and it's 31,000 cubic feet in size, and I weigh just over 100 kilos, so it's tailored for my size. Yeah. It has one tank of fuel, which is 60 litres, and that gives me about two hours and 20 minutes endurance. This shiny glimmer here, this is the waterproof coating and it's also the airproof coating. Without this, the balloon would not fly. So they have to be dried off, otherwise that eventually starts to bubble and uh, come off. So each balloon has what we call a rip line. It's attached to the side there and it goes all the way up to this vent here, and this vent is called the parachute. There is a pulley there in the middle, and if I pull this rope, this rope goes into the basket, and I have control of up and down. I don't have control of direction, but I have control of up and down. So before each flight, I have to make sure that there's no snags and nothing caught in the pulley. And of course this rip line then goes down into this pulley here and then finally to the basket. And that is how I control the balloon up and down. So if I were to pull this now, that parachute would come out and the balloon would deflate. 